Listen up, everyone. The Queen of England is coming, so everything must be in tip-top shape for her visit. Uh, Sir Tubham Hat? Yes, Thomas? I'm tired of delivering construction supplies. Could I do something different this week? Thomas, every job is equally important, but because you asked, you and Whiff may switch jobs. Really? Oh, thank you, Sir Top of Hat. <laughs> now, Thomas, go see Victor at the fitter's yard and let him know that you will be doing Whiff's job today. Right away, sir! And Thomas gleefully set off to see Victor. But little did he know, his job wasn't exactly what he had expected. Got a new job, everything's okay, and I'm going to work in a brand new way. It's gonna be fun, the useful engine way. Skip to my little, my darling. Burr? Victor, I'm taking over West job today. How do you happy about that? Uh -huh. Of course. Now I get to do something better. Hey, boss, doesn't he mean do do something better? <laughs> Kevin and Victor chuckled. Why are you laughing? Is there something I don't know? No, no, Thomas. We just know how much you don't like wearing snowplow. Uh, what's the snowplow for? Tis for pushing mud, but there's no need to worry. You'll make great new friend by clearing his mud. Great! I like new friends! And with his snowplow attached, Thomas happily chuffed off until he reached a large pile of mud on the tracks. Oh my goodness! That is one large pile of mud on the tracks. And woohoo! Does that stink? I guess I know why I've got my snowplow now. Snowplow now. Hmm. Can you say snowplow now five times fast? One, two, three, go! Snowplow now, snowplow now, snowplow now, so, 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 so. <laughs> That's funny. Oh my goodness. Is that another one? I don't ever remember mud smelling this bad before. Holy Mahoney! There's a third pile of mud? And this one smells the worst of them all! Ugh! Yuck! I'm gonna smell for a week. Maybe I should have been happy with the job I had before. Just then, Whiff came rolling by in the opposite track with fresh cut lumber for the workmen. Thomas, thank you so much for giving me a break today. It was a breath of fresh air not having to clean up Clifford's dog doo-doo. Uh, dog doo-doo? Very funny, Whiff. If that mud is dog doo-doo, then I'm the Queen of England. And just then, Clifford jumped out of the woods and barked the loudest bark Thomas has ever heard. Well then, just call me the Queen of England. You change the cat litter. I let you take out the garbage today, but don't tell mom and dad. They still think you're too young. Only good kids get to pick up the dog doo doo. Mm -hmm. Do you want to be good today? Send me my. This is Cliff Hume. Kids, the lesson of the day is don't eat what you don't know. This message has been brought to you by Subscribe Now. Good night. Am I done?